It's very much a temple of football, the Santiago Bernabeu, right here on the Spanish capital, Madrid. I'm Derek Ray, with me for commentary is Lee Dixon, and we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It's Paris Saint-Germain taking on Liverpool. Yeah, the long road to the final starts here in game one. Always think that if you win your home games and don't lose your away games, you've got a good chance of progressing. the attached glamour that is part of the story now it's always intriguing watching them in the Champions League these days Lee well it is when they're in a position to go out really and buy any player they want that does not give you an advantage especially when it comes to winning your own league but also in the Champions League as well and here is the initial 11 for Paris Saint-Germain Alphonse Areola starts in goal Thiago Silva plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. Ander Herrera starts alongside Marco Verratti in the engine room. And up front, Kylian Mbappe plays alongside Edinson Cavani. Let's take a look at the Liverpool starting eleven. The highly rated Brazilian Alisson begins between the posts. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside Joel Matip in central defence. Sadio Mane starts with Mohamed Salah out wide. And leading the attack today is the ultimate pressing machine, Roberto Firmino. Verratti now, a tremendous vision. And he was in the right place to intercept. He's given it straight to the opposition. Herrera. Firing it towards goal. Absolutely magnificent goalkeeping. Oh, he's almost turning away. He thinks he scored. The goalkeeper doesn't. And firing it into the area. Not messing around with that clearance. Neymar. He could pick out a teammate. Neymar. He's taken on his opponent here. It could be up for grabs. Cleared away comprehensively. Neymar. Then that. Edinson Cavani's in the vicinity. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Losing possession here. And Neymar really is up there amongst the current greats in the world game. Lee, as far as this match is concerned, what should we expect from the Brazilian? Well, virtually everything. Quick feet, quick mind, sees the pass before anybody else. So difficult to stop a player like that. Cavani now. And that cannot be placed by Cavani. Neymar! Well, he saw the whites of the keeper's eyes and the whites of his outstretched gloves. Great goalkeeping. Well, he's denied a certain goal there. Great reflexes from the keeper. It's Neymar's corner. Well, he was being very closely marked but the header not on the target. No, just off target, and the thing is, the defender did his job, and he just couldn't quite get enough of his head on it.
It's with Fabinho. And you've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. Excellent defending. Plenty of running room in the wide position. Well, they have the ball in a very promising position, but now it's been taken away from them. It's with Roberto Firmino. The referee has let the advantage accrue to Liverpool. Andrew Robertson. Salah. And Wijnaldum again. Read it magnificently and intercepted. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Well, an example of a counter-attack that went nowhere. Now Mo Salah. It's with Roberto Firmino. And moving the ball nicely. Henderson. Mini eight. Can they hit on the break? Looks as though they might make real progress on the counter-attack. Not so. Just straying offside. The referee has gone back now to hand out the yellow card. Opted for the laissez-faire approach. Most would say good refereeing, Lee. No, it's absolutely spot on. Keep the game going as long as you can, but then you can always go back and book him after the ball's gone out of play. Good refereeing. Now Minier. So tight this game. Who's going to break the deadlock? Be brave, be a hero, take chances. And it's a really good looking Paris Saint-Germain attack. What will they do next? Clattered away. Wijnaldum now. Henderson has it. It's with Roberto Firmino. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? All in all, a broken counter-attack. Neymar, here is Juan Bernat. Cavani, and fed forwards. He's in position, and a goal it is, the opener in this game. Well, keep it tight, that's what both managers would have been saying. But now the opening goal's gone in, tactics have got to change. Well, sometimes being at the right place at the right time gets you a goal. On this occasion, it's a simple goal from his point of view. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? And underway again here with PSG in front. The referee's verdict is three additional minutes. Wijnaldum. Henderson. It's a highly promising Liverpool attack, but will there be an end product? Salah! And that is that half-time here in the Spanish capital. He's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Lee? Well, his manager will be delighted with him. He's been spot on in this game, hasn't he? Energy, imagination, desire, and a steely determination. second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences it's with Roberto Firmino beautifully timed Neymar playing with purpose and control and into Cavani's in the vicinity that move looked as though it had genuine potential but it's broken down Giving the ball to the opposition that time. Van that and showing fine vision. Kylian Mbappe, does he mean business? And 
absolutely magnificent goalkeeping. Oh, he's almost turning away. He thinks he scored. The goalkeeper doesn't. And now the delivery. The goalkeeper relatively untroubled. Yeah, he's not, he's not going to let that one in, Derek. Van Nat. Ball's gone. They need to be careful here. And they'll have to throw it back in play. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Mbappe with it. He has time to play it over. Herrera! An opportunity to add to their advantage, but not taken. It was worth an effort, wasn't it? Too much space was given to him. Takes the shot on. Neymar. Here's Oxley Chamberlain. An incisive pass. Well, as the attacking side, you might dispute it, but offside by a hair. Yes, yeah, spot on from the linesman. Spot on, but he was close. Here's Mbappe. That's how to rob them of possession. Naby Keita. Good looking ball. There could be a chance now. Firmino. Alert defending. It did appear that they might be onto something, but not so. Di Maria. Neymar. Mbappe with it. Mbappe, Mbappe! Well, the shot from that position left a bit to be desired. You've just got to hit the target. Let the power down a little bit and go for accuracy. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. This is Salah. Here's Keita. It's with Roberto Firmino. Firmino. Oh, he's through here. It looked as though he might have been onside, but he was just a fraction off. Oh, I'm not so sure. I'd like to see that again. Di Maria. Matip now. Here's Oxley Chamberlain. Fabinho now. And that's an important intervention. In the second half, trailing, albeit by a small margin. How should they be viewing this task, Lee? Well, Liverpool haven't been at their best. A little off colour for me. And he takes on the shot. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. Fabinho now. Braxler now. Here's Mbappe. And they are on the move again. Good pressure. Can they make something of this? Nice! 
Take another look at this, there's nothing much the keeper can do. Close range finish, really good play, and he doesn't miss from there. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. So 2-0 now. Inside the final two minutes of this contest. Matip. And that was a very fine read. Nothing wrong with that idea. Great opportunity. Keeper did his job to begin with. Clattered away. This is Neymar. Promising sequence. And a significant block following that cross. And that is all for this game. It's an ideal start for Paddy Saint-Germain. They have three points from their first game in the Champions League. Well, it's everything you want from the start of match one. Good, strong start. That result will give everybody confidence, especially the players. Well done. So, Neymar hits the headlines again. And let's get an assessment of his performance, Lee. Well, he played well, scored a goal. What a good performance from him.